Hi, I'm Brian Mullen, Chief Marketing Officer at Influx Data, and I'm here on the show floor at AWS reInvent Las Vegas with Paul Dix, co-founder and CTO of Influx Data. So we're here to talk about data warehouses and data lakes. And this has been a pretty big topic for the year and a lot of momentum for these architectures driven a lot by open source. And so what I'd like to ask you, Paul, is what exactly is the role of InfluxDB in this architecture? So with InfluxDB version three, we prioritized integrating with other third-party systems. So the first part of this was the FDAP stack, which I've talked about before, Apache Arrow Flight, Data Fusion, Apache Arrow itself, and Parquet. Now Parquet is the file persistence format, and that's the first step. That makes it easier to share data across these other systems. Mm -hmm. Many of these data lake architectures are standardizing on Parquet as the file format they use for files in object storage. Oh, okay, so, so would it be fair to say that InfluxDB is actually bringing real time for developers to this architecture? That's correct, yeah. Like data lakes, data warehouses, they're more traditionally for larger scale query processing on data that's arriving slowly or there's some sort of ingestion pipeline. InfluxDB makes it so that you can have, you know, millisecond query latencies on data as it arrives. But adding Parquet as the persistence format and integrating with data lake architectures means we can share this data easily with other third-party providers like Databricks, Snowflake, Athena for Amazon. So looking ahead a little bit, what with this in mind, what do you think is next? For, what should we look for next from Influx? So I mentioned Parquet is the first step in this building block. The next stage for us is to add support for Apache Iceberg. So Iceberg is a standard within data lakes for sharing this data. So we'll be adding that support over the coming months and then seeing what people do with it. Well, thanks, Paul. So it sounds like InfluxDB brings the notion of real time to these existing systems. Yeah, that's right. Thanks for joining us. We can't wait to see what you do with InfluxDB.